in a world where, uh, where, um, in a world where I am doodling, I picked up a wood burner and made this, or something. Uh, <laughs> anyways, thanks for tuning in. Just a little advance notice. Um, if you get motion sickness from videos easily, this one has a lot of spinning and stuff in it, um, out of pure necessity. So I don't really know what type of stuff causes motion sickness, because I don't really get it. Um, but, you know, there's your disclaimer all the same. Here's another wood burning, as I was saying. Well, maybe it's cooler to call it a pyrograph. Mm. <laughs> yeah, 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 that sounds much cooler. Um, you can see I have a Celtic knot of sorts in the middle of this one. I've always loved these things. Uh, I used to draw them a lot more, and I can't really remember why I stopped. Maybe it's just because there's so many things to draw. I got, just got distracted. Also, um, it can be daunting because it's so easy to make little mistakes that stick out like a severed thumb on an ice skating rink when you're drawing these knots. But uh, they are rewarding and satisfying when you get it right, I think. Uh, this is another piece of box elder wood. I breezed through the Wikipedia page on box elder, and I didn't see anything about the notable pink streaks, but uh, it could have just been that I didn't read closely enough. But I assure you... I bought this stuff and my wood burner from uh, a nice woodworking shop called Kling Spores, and the label said Box Elder, so I trust them. Um, in this pyrograph, I used a tip I hadn't really used before to do all the really dark shading that also hadn't really, um, I hadn't really tried something like that before. I wasn't actually going to make it that dark, but then I accidentally did a spot like that, and at that point, I just had to carry on and make it all like that. And it's fine. Everything's fine. I hope you're doing fine. I know I am. Uh, thanks for watching my video, by the way. I don't know if I would keep making these if no one watched them, but I'd like to think I would. Also, this will be on my Etsy shop as well if you want to buy it. Um, and this took me about three and a half hours, maybe a little more, but I did it in two separate sittings on two different days. Uh, also, I should have some cool stuff coming up soon, just a teaser. It will involve a fox and a bear. Uh, should be good. I'm excited. No, I will not be riding the bear or the fox. There won't actually be a real live living bear or fox either, so don't get your hopes too high. Anyways, um, that's all for now. I'll see you guys um, next time. And uh, should I ask any questions in the comments? I'll try to answer the relevant ones. Um, yeah. <laughs> all right, see you guys.